I'll come back to Scotland. Um, I'm going to see my mum and dad in Paisley, near Glasgow, uh, and I'm going to find out what they know about our family history because I know gently little. I think it's um, quite a common experience amongst Scots to develop a kind of nationalism after you leave. Um, I certainly feel very particularly Scottish now in a way that I probably didn't when I lived here. I mean, my heritage is Celtic. Um, I'm almost completely Scottish. There's a bit of Irish in there, but I certainly, I certainly feel like a Scot. I don't have a key anymore. Good to see you. Good to, good to be you. here. Hi, Dave. All right. Yeah, good to see you. Hi. So, we'll get the kettle on. That's a proper welcome home, isn't it? It's to do. And Mum's apple pie. <laughs> oh, look at that. Come home. David was born David MacDonald, but like many aspiring actors, had to change his name to join the Actors' Union. I just opened a, a magazine because I... A pop group or something, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Somebody in a pop group. Mm. Neil, Neil Tennant and was in Smash Hits and I just thought the name sounded yeah. good. Yeah, but if you remember, we tried to persuade you to maybe go to a family. Yes, I do yeah. remember that, but I think at 16 I wasn't having any of that. Well, because parents, when you're 16, parents know nothing, of course. Quite right. Quite right. 16 year olds know everything. Did you you wanted nothing. me to be McLeod, didn't you? Well, you could have used McLeod, you could have used Blair, you could have used any of those names, mm. you know. David's maternal grandparents were Irish Nellie Blair and Scott Archie MacLeod. And it's his Scottish heritage that David wants to research first. I'm David, nice David. to meet you. Do come in. Thank you. So he's asked genealogist Brian Thompson to help. So far, Brian's managed to trace back to the 1860s to an ancestor called Donald MacLeod. And his job in Glasgow was an ironware. When we go to the census we, with the name MacLeod, we might start to find that he was actually from somewhere else. Oh. Um, and I think it might be useful, David, if you want to follow this up. Yeah. We could actually go online. You have a chance of finding him on the 1861 census and see what it says. David can now research the MacLeod line through three generations, from his grandfather Archie MacLeod to Archie's own grandfather, Donald MacLeod. Where do we start? Right, go on to www.scotlandspeople.gov.uk. Right, we said we'd have a look at the 1861 right. census. So do you want to try typing in your... MacLeod. Yes, type in MacLeod. Let's go down to see the Glasgow, if that helps. That there he is. Oh, oh there McLeod. he is. Uh-huh. Labourer. Yep. From the island of Mull. He was born in Mull, uh -huh. Kilninian. Kilninian and the island of Mull. So we come from Mull? Yep. I've been to Mull, it's lovely. Have you? I didn't yes, know we came from there. Yes. Uh -huh. We're off to see my brother Tim at his house. He was around for more of my parents' marriage. He was around for more of my dad's life. So I'm hoping he remembers more stuff than I know. I'm going into Edinburgh to see my Auntie Marion, who's staying with friends here, and uh, she's my mum's big sister, and she's the last link to the, to the French family. She, she was born a volant.